I talked about that. He turned over the tables. He made a scourge and he drove them out. Yeah. It ain't in the word. The church ought not to be doing it. Mm -hmm. A lot of people disagree with me and that's fine. But this should be our guide. Right. Amen. This and nothing but this. Not my opinion, not what I think. Many will say, well, I think it's okay. I don't care what you think. What does the word say? That's right. That's right. Amen. Like I said, there's more, Lord willing, we'll get into it tonight. I, I will stop there, but I really want you to get this part of it. The reason we're talking about this is because I want it to become real to you. I want you to understand this really is going to happen. It's not fairy tales. It's not just scary bedtime stories. This stuff's coming, and it's coming fast. And, and again, you may say, I've heard it all my life. Watch the news, see what's going on, and then you will have to know it can't go much longer. It cannot. We can't sustain this. It can't happen. So you must know that it's coming soon. And Christians, we got a job to do before it gets here. We got people to reach, people to pull out of the fire. I'll stop there and Lord willing will continue tonight. Let's reverence the Lord. Father, we thank you once again for your blessings. Lord, for the privilege to be here in your house. We thank you for this place, and we thank you for this people. Lord, we thank you that there are still those who want to know the truth, who want to hear the word, who want to be what you want them to be. And I pray, God, that you would help us to be that people. Help us to take your word and apply it to our hearts and apply it to our mind and apply it to our lives. Lord, help us to go out and to make a difference in this world, to reach the lost, to bring in those who have been deceived. God, just help us to be that that witness that you would have us to be. And I pray, God, as we go from this place, that you would go with us. Watch over each and every one. Keep each and every one. Keep your hand of protection and mercy on them. Look on their hearts, God, and meet whatever needs are present there. Maybe they even needs they don't know. God, but you can reveal it to them. And God, I thank you and I pray, Father, that you would bring us back together again. And we ask these things in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Any word? Right. One of my youngest daughters' favorite song is what a